Well, we are back at it. We were up in Bayfield trolling for some spring trout. We got uh, some plain laner boards out. We're running some shallow diving lures. Got dad driving the boat right now. And John up front, he's gonna be a net man for us today and check some other stuff out, but uh, we're at it. We're out here hoping for some trout. Fish. Oh, yep, yep. Keep us going. Oh, it just popped off. Yep, it just popped off. So you got to bring it in or? Nope, it's good. Darn it. Yeah, it just, that was pulling the whole board back. And where it was supposed Fish. to. Fish. Oh, boy, it just had a hit. Huh? This rod just went wham. Yeah? Which one was it? This one right here. Yeah? The short one. Just whoom. You didn't see it? No, I was looking no, we at it. we were just, we were caught daydreaming. <sighs> it just went smash. Oh, that's two Now hits. I see your color change. Yeah. I'll follow that. I don't care how deep the water is. <laughs> bing, 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 bing. God, they're doing willies. Yeah, they're bouncing hard. I'm only doing three and a half. Well, we just turned around and started headed back into the wind, and these boards are giving her. We're trying to stay about three miles an hour or so. <laughs> Throttle glove. It's too big. Oh, there we go. There's snag. That's fish. Oh, we are on. Yep. Yeah, we're hooked up. That's big. Where's that camera? It's big. John's got John's on it. Oh, don't tell me it just came off. Nope, we're still good. No, it came off. Another one came off. That's our third fish that we've had come off. That one felt big too. It looked big. I seen a rod bouncing. Dang it. Yeah, it's gone. That was a big fish. I thought we were snagged for a second. It was it was big. We're oh, back we're in, back on, we're back on. We're back in 25 feet. Back on. Good deal. Back on. Back off again. Come on, keep keep, keep going, keep going with the keep boat. Keep reeling. He might be swimming towards you. Maybe. Let's see what lure this is. Yeah, maybe it's still there. Can you unclip the board? I don't know if I can. Yeah, the lure is out of the water. The lure is out. That's a tough one. Okay, we're good. Where's the lure? Right here. It's the reef runner. It's the reef runner. He hit it, it got hit twice. It got hit oh. twice through there. Well, this is what. We're in 40 feet of water now. That really? That wasn't where we hit him though. No, I was in 18. That was in 18? Yes. Oh. I'm gonna put a swivel on here because this thing was spinning to all be. It's so weird that we haven't been able to keep a fish hooked up. <sighs> Why, it why is, is that? It's, it's not like we stopped. It's not like we jerked a rod. It's yeah, like no, I literally was holling it and you don't pump them, you don't nothing. You just slowly reel, right? Like yeah. that's all you do. Yeah. And I did, that's what I did. Like I didn't set the hook because the hook's already set, you just, Start you know, reeling. Popping it in and out of neutral, or in and out of gear. You don't have to do that, just go right down to the lowest. Oh, okay, okay. Keep it right in gear, and just I pop always... it as low, and then we can adjust. Then if it's a big fish, then we'll kick it in and out of gear. Just to keep us going a little bit. Just ever, just ever so slightly. Well, we've been fishing the uh, bay on the Bayfield side, Got a, we had a few bites, probably four or five, and uh, we're gonna head over to Madeline Island, which is over there. And we're gonna troll in Madeline Island on the edge of it. Well, we just got to Madeline Island. We're gonna troll down this shoreline towards the restaurant, towards the town. Let's get some fish. Working hard at them today. 
Holy It is raining, ain't it? Yeah, I noticed that on the way over. I was like, that's not the boat splashing, that's rain. You do a couple loops in there? Yeah, and, just and so then, it wraps then, around and that. And cinch it down? Yeah, just so it wraps around that post a little bit. Huh. Oh, we got a fish. Here you go. You sure? Yeah, it's under. It's under that. Oh, yeah, there's a fish here. Pop her in or out or what? No, no just keep going. Drop it, just drop it to the lowest. It's still on. All right. We well, got a fish. We're hooked up. And I don't feel it anymore, but I'm gonna keep on rolling in. I don't. I don't feel anything. No. Is it gonna jump? Yeah. No. There's nothing here. It was there. We'll let it back out. It, it feels like something's there, unless it's the bill. I don't know, I'll keep pulling it in after all that slack. Yeah, there's a there's a fish here. We're hooked up. I think we got a little coho or something. Do you boat flip these or net them? Oh, oh, this one going, this one, this yeah, one. That's this snag, one. that's snag. Kill it. I'm in neutral. Brown. Brown. Cool. We got a keeper brown and we got snagged Let up. some line out of that. We're going to have a mess. Um, Just throw it in the live well. Open that up right there. We're going to get this fish in the live well. Twist it. Other way. Oh, there's a net in there. Hold them right there. Okay. All right, we got to pick up boards because we got one snagged. It's going to be a mess. How deep did we end up going? How shallow did we end up? Nine, Nine feet. feet. You lost that board or did you take that one off? They just lay it down. You got this one off? You got grass on this one. I got it. Backing down or backing up? Holy smokes, we got a fish in the boat, guys. And we got snagged as we got a fish. Is that what it's it is? What? Yeah, it's a rope. It's you ain't ever getting it out of a rope. No, nope, bye bye. That's one of them. Some of these mooring ropes or something. <laughs> All right, guys, there we go. First fish of the day. Nice little brown. This is definitely a keeper eater fish. So probably put it on a smoker or even just fillet it up and put it right in the pan. Cool. We're on the Beautiful. board. We are on the board. Nice Check looking it out. fish. Yeah. Yeah. Probably a 17 inch brown. Got a little tape in here, we'll give her a quick measure. Cause out here, they do have to be 15 to keep. And this fish is exactly 17, 17 and a half. Good to go. We're on the board. We're doing something right. All right, All right, so we're gonna get back out there. Hopefully we can do it again. We're right in front of Madeline Island, guys. You could, anybody can do this. You got the boat, rip over here, start trolling next to shore, this early spring bite. Yes, let's, let's just keep doing that, hopefully. You get that first fish in the boat and it's just like you did something right. Absolutely. All right. Awesome. You see that brick ball coming in. That's gotta go, man. You gotta get a fish on that. We'll get a fish right next to the break wall. How'd I do? Perfect. Something's gonna go here. Let's go, fishy.
What time is it? It is 6.13. 6 Holy cow, we were out here like all day long. And we had a few get off in the morning, caught the one brown, and then we trolled back and forth along Madeline Island and they just weren't fighting today. Temperature in the water was about 36 degrees and that sweet spot that you want is probably 40, between 40 and what did you say, 50, John? 40, 45. 40 to 45 is, is about the sweet spot, he says. But we're out here, this is our first time, we're learning. Definitely gonna come back up here. Dad. Great, great time. Dad drove the boat all day, did the troll and he did, did I a- do a good job? Oh, perfect, perfect. Well, I, figured I'd let, I figured I'd let you fish for a change. Yeah, right. But uh, yeah, it was a good time. Um, I had a great time. What did we learn? The brown trout ate a bright green holographic lure right in front of Madeline Island. So, yeah. but like always, guys, hope you enjoyed. If you haven't hit the subscribe button, love it if you hit that subscribe button. And thanks for watching. See you next time.